Hello, Boise Braves, and welcome to KBHS TV. Today is Thursday, October 25th. I'm Brayden Vandell. And I'm Spencer Roy, and these are your weekly video announcements. Spencer, do you feel kind of weird? You know, now that you say something, I do feel a little disconnected. Well, I hope I feel better by next week. Wednesday is Halloween, you know. That's right. Here I was, thinking we were getting ahead of ourselves, but it all makes sense now. Our advanced students have been hard at work preparing some spooky segments for this show. We've always chosen one winner, but this year, we're asking you viewers to decide. Here's Cherish and Joey with their hollowed tale. Take a look. pass back a very important, super big, important test. Oh man, F minus? <laughs> Cherish, no bodily organs on the floor. Yeah, because I was totally planning to just leave them there. the next day. Alright class, I'm going to pass back a very important, super big, important test. You are quite literally out of your mind if you didn't enjoy that. Drew that. I think I left my head off. Okay, so that was option one. Here's Thomas with choice number two. Roll it. Man, I haven't been down here in years. This place gives me the creeps. There are so many ghosts down here. Oh my- Oh my- You can feel the energy, can't you? Yeah. Bad juju. Welcome back to Brave Bumps Unsolved, where on this episode we're going to be uncovering the dark mysteries of my dad's basement and the convict that used to inhabit it. A convict? Did you really have a convict inhabiting your basement? Heck yeah, I did. Andy had been living in the basement for eight years when they found him, and he would only come out once every third trimester of a blood relative's pregnancy to commit tax fraud. Oh, he's one sick cookie. I'm glad he's out of there now. Well... He escaped from prison a few weeks ago, but the government doesn't want you to know, or else it could spark nationwide unrest. After all, he's the most dangerous convict of all time. I guess we better watch out for convicts then. No, this basement has been convict free since 2016, which is why it's completely safe to spend the night here because there isn't anything that can hurt us. All right, <clears throat> let's look around and set up our sleeping bags. That night, our cameras picked up Andy the convict himself, stealing our tax dollars. And I'm not even going to put this on my tax form. Oh, my money's gone. 
Me too. And you struck last night. <sighs> we gotta put him away for good this time. <laughs> oh, <c> Holy <laughs> Andy, where are you? Come on, Andy. Come out, come out oh, wherever man. you are. I don't see him anywhere. Andy! And wait. There's one spot we didn't check. Okay, listen, in convict. We're gonna take care of you. Please, no! Well, looks like we caught us a convict here on this episode of Brave Bumps Unsolved. There's so much money to steal! So Man, where's that body at, though? You know, I'm thinking that's gonna be another mystery that's gonna have to go unsolved. So, I guess so. Cut! Nice. Good job, nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's time for today's club and event news. Henry, tell us what's happening. I'm Henry Passy, and it's time for your club and activity report. Attention all juniors, do you know what bus you are riding on Halloween? And no, this is not a joke. The National College Fair at Expo Idaho is happening on Wednesday. Please plan to check list in the counseling wing to learn your bus number. Here's who's meeting today at lunch. Film Club is in 423, Club Unify is in 118, French Conversation Club is in 527, and HOSA is in 104. Well, this has been Henry, and you are officially up to date. Back to you, Spencer. Let's turn things over to Tyler at our sports desk. Tyler, tell us the score. Hi, Braves. I'm Tyler Anderson, and it's time to talk sports. Congratulations to both our girls and boys soccer team for, for a great showing at State last weekend. The boys brought back third place and the girls came home with the second place trophy. Way to go, Braves. Good luck to our volleyball team as they enter state tournament play at Ridgeview High School tomorrow. The Braves would love your support, to, so to take advantage of a day off and head out to Nampa to cheer them on to victory. Well, that's your sports wrap. This has been Tyler reporting, and now back to you, Spencer. Now it's time for today's words of wisdom. November 6th is an important date for all citizens 18 and over to get out and vote. However, today is a time that everyone's voice can be heard. Teachers, take a poll. Which Halloween video did your class most enjoy? Video 1 by Joey and Cherish or Video 2 by Thomas? Please email your class vote to Miss Bridges by lunch today. Remember, you can make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. This has been Spencer. And I'm Braden. Sharon, what's up? Thanks for watching, Boise High. <laughs>